What's going on guys? So I'm out and about in southwestern Virginia doing a little mushroom hunting and I was actually on my way home. I didn't find much today, but I came across Trimetes Versicolor. <laughs> try, try, try meat. Really? It's Trimetes Versicolor. Not try. <laughs> it's the turkey tail mushroom. If you're interested, stick around. Okay, there it is. Look at that. It's actually two different two small flushes and uh, two different colors and I just thought that was super cool um, this mushroom is uh, never has the same color it seems uh, but we can definitely tell it's a turkey tail uh, if I was to break off one of these fronds right here let's break off that one right there and pull it, turn it over we've got a white polypore and this is it that's the telltale sign right there obviously uh, the color where it gets its name, the turkey tail. You can see the different bands in there. Very beautiful mushroom. It's got that velvety feel to it. Wonderful medicinal properties. But I'm actually gonna leave this flush. This isn't my my land, so I'm gonna I'm gonna leave it right here. So if I was anyplace else, I probably would harvest this and take it back to the house and make a tea with it. Uh, it's such a great tasting mushroom. Uh, it really it really embodies that that mushroomy flavor um, and it is just wonderful as far as health is concerned but how beautiful is that I mean that's just fantastic love all the different colors and you know if we hold it up to this other one right here you can really tell that this one is a lot lighter uh, than this specimen very pretty though very bendy very pliable full of chitin hard to break this mushroom you can just see it roll right in my fingers. Super cool. Awesome. So this is a saprophytic mushroom, and we can tell right here is an old stump. You can see it's breaking down, and that's what this mushroom's doing. It's, it's decomposing uh, this, this old stump that's right here in the middle of the trail. So super cool. Love that guy. Wish I could harvest it, but I'm not going to. Gotta be respectful of other people's property, so. Awesome, very cool. Now I mentioned the taste of this mushroom is wonderful, but I only utilize it in a tea, and I don't recommend eating it because it, it's just too full of chitin in your system. It's gonna be very hard for your system to break this mushroom down. So the tea, in my opinion, is the best way to utilize it, to get all that good medicinal value out of it. You know, I'm always amazed at the color variations uh, in the turkey tail mushroom. I mean, sometimes they're really blue, gray, uh, olive green, that's another one. Um, and I th actually, I think that one of those actually had a little olive in it, um, brown. It's just, uh, I've actually seen them kind of burgundy. I mean, very beautiful mushroom, beautiful, beautiful. Um, and I just think that's super cool because they're never the same. The color variations are always different. So. Anyway, hey, thanks for spending your time with me. I really do appreciate it. Please don't forget to subscribe. Slap that like button. I'll talk to you.